Hi, last time I saw you, we were looking at a dream home. Today, we're gonna look at a home of every busy family's dreams. Welcome to the Fairfax or the Franklin. No matter which one you choose to build, the included layout of this home is exactly the same. And I wanna make sure I point that out to you today. This is the number one floor plan that is chosen by the families that choose to build with us. So we're gonna show it to you. Now, working from home can be a blessing for many of the people that build with us, but if the only option for you to work from home is being regulated to a corner of the basement, that doesn't work for everyone. You can miss deliveries, miss the kids walking home from school. This floor plan offers you a flex room right up front so that you can actually interact with your home while you're working from the day. And if it isn't a home office, it could be a music room, a formal living room, a playroom. Our, our buyers have done all kinds of things, but one one thing that has been important is being able to have a, a space for a home office. Now, new construction often doesn't give you much space in hallways and in foyers. This foyer is more than six feet wide and it allows not only for your guests to come in, but you're not on top of each other while you're putting on coats. Space gets taken out of these kinds of places to allow for other amenities and you may not realize it, but it's so important when you want a home to feel like a home. Now. Formal dining room might be a thing of the past, but they're, to some of our buyers, they're very important. This floor plan not only offers you an office, but also a formal dining room space. And if that isn't for you, I'm gonna show you an option on what you can do with it. Now, open concept shouldn't be a concept anymore. There isn't anybody that wants to cook by themselves in the kitchen while the kids are living in the living room by themselves. This floor plan is wide open to allow everybody to have sight lines and interaction with each other. Remember what I said about the dining room? Well, we expanded the island. This is optional, but this allowed for an eat-in kitchen without giving you two sit down tables. Now, if you did want a cafe table in a formal dining room, that's an option. You would just have the standard island. But this island is so important to people today. Kitchen design may be something that you don't really think about. You just expect the experts to know it. But until you cook in a kitchen, you can't know where the problems lie. You shouldn't have to stop traffic in your kitchen because you want to interact with your appliances. This kitchen allows for plenty of workspace while allowing a whole another area for people to pass through and interact with you while the, uh, the cook is in the kitchen. Now, I wanna spend some time in this owner's entry because if there is one piece of this two-story family home that I think absolutely hits the bill is that you need a place for everything, for everything to be in its place. And this boot bench, whether you have us construct it or you just put up hooks and shelves of your own, allows you to put down all those things that you come in from the garage with. Book bags, soccer bags, laptop bags, groceries, mail. Not only do you have a place to put it all down before you get to your island, but you also have a place to take care of all of the things that happen when you get home. Now, I think we've all been in somebody's home that has a door to the bathroom right off the living room space. This powder room is tucked back here in the corner to offer not only your guests and yourself some privacy while the others are watching Jeopardy, but the little ones that come straight in from the garage have quick access to the bathroom, and we all have had those issues. One very important piece to me is that if the owner is going to be managing, managing these busy schedules, they need a place to manage it from that isn't the floor of the living room or the island. This command center space is dedicated for this to be where you manage your home. The cabinetry can be included. That's something we can add for you, that's optional, but you can put your own desk here with the electric, you can run your laptop and run the household. Now, if, if you've ever lived in a two-story home or stayed the night in a two-story home, you know how hard it is in Missouri to regulate the temperatures on the second floor as well as the first floor. And you shouldn't have to worry about that. Whether you're building the Franklin or the Fairfax, there are two thermostats included. This thermostat regulates just the first floor. And I'll show you the second thermostat in a second. Dark stairwells are a thing of the past. The Fairfax and the Franklin both include a very large, ample, window right here in the middle of the stairwell. That may not seem like a big deal or it should be just a check mark. We agree with you, but a lot of home builders make that an extra. Loft space. It sounds like it's so wonderful to have a functional loft. You gotta question function. If your loft space sits right on top of your living room, it's not functional. But you don't wanna have to finish your basement and have that expense to have a second living room or game room for your kids. Now, this cabinetry being installed, this is an option. Imagine if there was 
a full-size couch, a, a TV, a location for your kids to just sit down, relax, play, do their homework, that can happen right up here. And the sound isn't carrying down to the first floor. There are three secondary bedrooms that come off of this loft space. All of those secondary bedrooms, while very important to your family, one big thing that the owner's gonna need is a place to do all their laundry. Second floor laundries are often an option. Here, this is standard. The only thing you're carrying upstairs is your dish towels. Now, the kids in the household can't be happy if the owner's not happy. So let me introduce you to your owner's retreat. That second thermostat we were talking about, right here. So if it's hot or cold upstairs, you have a place that you can manage that for yourself. This master uh, retreat not only has plenty of space for a king size bed and room to move around it also has a walk-in closet and a bathroom with all of the finishes that are needed for an owner to have a space of their own whether this is the franklin or the fairfax this home has so much to offer we have 11 of these homes built right now for those of you that want to move check us out at painfamilyhomes.com